What is up, Dokkan player? Welcome back to the channel. It is your boy, Blaze. Today, we are back with another Dokkan battle video. Today, before we start the video, hopefully, you guys are having a very, very good day today. Also, before I continue, I do want to say a very special thank you to everyone that showed up actually to the live stream. Uh, I do want to know that was just a mistake. I was just, I thought I was on private, but you know what? I am working things out on the live stream, but it should be coming soon. I am working through it, but uh, we're almost there with the live stream. But again, thank you very much for the support. Really, really did appreciate it. Uh, so today we have a very interesting video here because tomorrow, as you guys know, we are getting a revamp of the 200% combat stimulation for the freeze event. And now this week, or for the next day here, sorry, uh, is going to be the Resurrected Warriors here. So I do want to, I think this one is going to be one of the easier ones here. Also, I do want to kind of update uh, my team builds here just because um, I forgot to mention that in the last video, my, my uh, team building video, uh, you actually have different stages as well here. So I'm even much more specific. But uh, today, this one be the Resurrected Warriors. Now, this one here should be pretty simple, I want to say, because there's a lot of great units here um, to get this to get the job done. And also, I mean, most people should have this unit as well here. So for doing the Resurrected Warriors, um, I would definitely go, of course, with the double lead of Candy Gigito. If, of course, if you do have him here. So let's actually go here to Patara. Also, I've been having some comments. Uh, what is this website here? This is called the Dolcon Battle Optimizer. Very easy to find. Just type it in Google, and then you'll find the website here. So, of course, you want to go with Double Candy Vegito as your leader here because, again, he is your best nuking leader. If you don't have, of course, Candy Vegito because right now the event's not yet out um, on Global, then, of course, you can use Goten. If you don't have Goten, then, of course, you can use the leader for Resurrected Warriors. But for now, we're just going to go with the Double Candy Vegito because I feel like a lot of players are going to have this unit here. So, Double Candy Vegito, and now we want to look at the Resurrected Warriors here. So... I mean, this one here should be very, very simple. So, of course, if you are using double, uh, let's actually go STR here. Just like that. Boom, there we go. So, now, if you are using double Candy Vegito, this should be very, very simple. And the reason why is because of this Majin Vegeta here. This Majin Vegeta is really, really good. Just in case you guys don't know what he does, he is a nuking leader. And plus, he does have an advantage against a Goku's family, which, of course, is the enemy. So, if we look here, Majin Buu, he's very, very good. Uh, he greatly rise attack for one turn. Cost supreme damage to the enemy. Actually, sorry, this is the extreme Z area. Uh, so once he's easy A, he does really raise attack and defense. But the most important part is going to be attack here. And also, he is a orb changer as well. And he gets attack and defense plus 20% per key to obtain. Plus additional 5% when facing a Goku's family. So he's going to get 25% uh, attack per um, key to obtain. So that's really, really good. And of course, you want to be using... Um, Candy Vegito as your leader here. So he's going to hit very, very hard. You could finish this in one turn. Now, you also want to bring here, of course, your linking partner, sir. So let's actually take out the STR. And, of course, you want to build around this, oops, this Majin Vegeta here. So his best linking partner is, of course, going to be here, the Tech Super Saiyan 2 um, Vegeta here. If I can, there he is. So they do share some links together, which is pretty good. Uh, you also want to bring here Kid Buu as well. Now, what's, what's actually a very good option here as well is that you could also bring the hit, the 50% sorry, 50 support hit. You could bring him as well. Uh, and just in case he does survive, Goku, if Goku actually does survive, if you are doing the physical stage um, using the Majin Vegeta here, you could also bring Broly. Broly is fantastic. The reason why the STR Broly is because he does attack multiple times. So just in case he does survive with a sliver of health, then Broly can come up and clean the mess. But again, this all really depends on RNG here. So again, this is going to be a, your team build, should be very, very good. And of course, you want to bring here a hit as well. So let me actually just go and do this. Take out the Resurrected Warriors, just like that. All right, there we go. And go STR, Extreme. And then we should be able to find hit here. So hit, you are going to be right here. There you go. So there you go, boom. That's a very good team build. And of course, you can bring here uh, the, the, the friend as a Candy Vegito. If you're not able to find Candy Vegito, you could bring Gotenks. I mean, Gotenks, sorry. And if you can't find Goten, then I mean you could bring Frieza as your leader because he is part of the um, he is part of the Resurrected Warriors as well here. So let's actually go here to Resurrected Warriors. Uh, where are you? There you go, Resurrected Warriors. We'll take out the STR. There we go. I mean you could use this team build here. I mean this will be very very solid. Again, if you don't have hit, then of course you can bring. Um, let's actually just put Frieza here as the leader. Where is Frieza? Frieza, Resurrected Warriors, there we go. So again, just in case you're not able to find a Candy Vegito friend, I mean, it could happen. You could use Goten or you can use Frieza here. It's not a big issue here. Uh, but yeah, if you don't have hit as well, that's A-OK -okay because you can also bring here um, 
Where is it? Where uh, there's cooler, another support type unit, which would be very, very good. So I mean, this will be very, very nice. Again, hit will be much better. Reason why is because both Broly and um, Vegeta here are extreme class, so they are gonna get that 50% attack raise, which is really, really good. I mean, you got options here, but I mean, I would still go with double candy Vegito. You just need a little bit of RNG. The rotation that you are gonna be looking for is gonna be this type of rotation. So let's actually put you guys here. Uh, Broly, you want to be on a second rotation. And then you just want to have support here. So that's going to be pretty much it. Um, again, they do share five links together. But again, Broly does attack additional in his passive. So he's going to be very, very good. You just want to make sure that both Broly and the SR Majin Vegeta do get a lot of orbs. Because they will be able to kill Goku here. Now, just for example, if you don't have this Majin Vegeta, which I'd be pretty shocked. But I mean, it could happen. And you don't have Broly. Uh, you still have some options here. So that's going to be for the physical stage here. So now let's look here at the, um, oops, let's actually look here at the, let's actually look here at the end stage here. So let's say you decide to go against the end stage here for the event. So let's actually go back here. Let's go back here again. And let's say you want to go and tackle the end stage here because you don't have any STR units, right? So you could bring here, uh, this is Resurrected Warriors. We still have some very good options. Now, of course, you still want to go with the Kano Vegeta lead or the Goten lead as your leader because they're your best nuking leader. Um, you could do this here. So let's actually get back Kano Vegito. Let's go and give this here. And then we're going to go and do Resurrected Warriors just like that. And then Kabang. So again, if you do not have right the Broly and if you don't have Majin Vegeta for some, for some odd reason, you could bring this LR uh, Vegeta. Now, he's very, very good. He is part of the category. Especially if you bring the Super Saiyan 2 Goku, he will hit very, very hard. So let's actually go and get Super Saiyan 2 Goku very quickly. Uh, let's actually just go to... Is there Kamehameha anywhere? There we go. Boom. Let's go physical. Alright, so you definitely want to bring this Goku here. Again, it doesn't matter if he's not part of the category. You just want to make sure that who's ever attacking Goku has to be part of the Resurrected Warriors. So this going to be a very strong rotation, especially if you give him the, um, the Limo item. Or the, the, the Bora cookie, sorry. Um, that would be very, very strong. Uh, another unit you want to bring here as well. If we actually go back to... Let's actually take you out here. Let's actually go back to Resurrected Warriors. Just like that. You could bring Frieza here. Now, Frieza is insane. If I can find him. Frieza, where are you? There you go. So, this Frieza is new on Global. I mean, there's a chance that you did pull him. But he's going to be very, very good. Of course, you want to bring your Kid Buu as well as your support. And, of course, you could also bring here... Um, cooler here as well which would be very good because he actually does link up pretty well with the frieza here so again this frieza you could transform on turn one which is very very good and he does do quite a lot of damage here as well here but again this should be able to get you the, the run done in two turns uh let's actually go ahead and put candy vegeto again as your your friend lead here let's go here to patara just like that boom there we go so of course the rotation you want to see happen is jeff you want this goku with the vegeta here and also you want your second rotation to be um, cooler there you go with Frieza because again they do share three links uh, you could also bring golden Frieza so for example let's say you don't have Tanya Vigil as your leader here you can still bring uh, this is Potara you could still bring the Int Frieza here as well so let's actually go back to Resurrected Warriors confirm and where is Frieza going to be Frieza you're going to be right here so boom there you go I mean it could also be vice versa so I mean you still have options of course the run you want to have is going like this type of rotation here so I mean very very good I mean I definitely believe you can have this done in two turns especially with this Majin Vegeta because again he does so much damage um, mine's only 55% but I still believe you have enough if you actually get a whole field of orbs of physical or STR whatever orb you're gonna get uh, you can definitely one-shot this with this Vegeta because he hits so goddamn hard. Uh, it's going to be really, really good here. So, again, you have options here. Uh, but again, I, I would still go with the double lead of Candy Vegito just because he's, you know, the best leader for New King. Uh, so that's going to be for the int type. Now, let's say you don't have, of course, you don't have this Vegeta here. And you don't have this Frieza. And you don't have the um, SCR Majin Vegeta or the SCR Broly. I mean, you still have options. Um, the other category you could do here. So we've done Int. We've done um, Physical. And another one you could do is be AGL. So, of course, uh, I should keep Candy Vegito as the leader here. Again, you could use Candy Vegito as your leader. It's not a big deal. Uh, very easy to get. So let's actually go and give this here to you. And then let's go back to Resurrected Warriors. So this one here is kind of like 
a risky play, but I mean, it depends what you have in your box. Uh, you could bring Cell here. Cell is fantastic. He is a nuker. Uh, just in case you guys don't know what he does, I believe he gets 15% per key sphere he gets. So, I mean, you still have options if you don't have any of like, the top tier cards. Uh, let's actually go look for Cell. And Cell, you are going to be right here. So, Cell is actually very good. So, of course, he has to be extremely awakened. Uh, his attack and defense plus 15% per key sphere obtained. So, he is a nuking lead, I mean, nuking character, which is very, very good. Uh, you definitely want to pair him up with another cell unit. So let's just say, I don't know. Let's go with. Let's see who's your best linking partner here. I think it's going to be the cell here. So let's actually bring you here. Uh, and then of course here you could also bring Broly if you want to as well. I mean Broly is going to hit very very hard, but you could also bring the Majin Vegeta because Majin Vegeta does hit very very hard as well here. So let's just say you don't have Broly, you could bring the Majin Vegeta, and now of course you want to pair him up with. Uh, where is the SDR Vegeta here? Um, Majin Vegeta, where are you at? Where are you at? Did I miss him? I must have missed him. Oh, there he is, right there. So, boom. So, it has to be a very, very good turn. And then, of course, you want to bring your support as well. Which, of course, is going to be the Kid Buu here. So, boom, there we go. And then, of course, you want to bring Double Candy Vegito. Uh, and then, you want to bring, of course, your Russian Roulette or any other Orb Changer uh, nuking units here. Uh, uh, sorry, items here, sorry. So by doing that, uh, you still have a very strong team build here. So let's actually go back to Patara. And then, boom, there we go. So it's going to be a very strong turn. Of course, you want cells together because they share five links together. And you want to have these two together because they share also five links as well. And basically, hopefully, you know, um, you want to kid Boo here with actually with, with Cell here. So that's going to be your golden rotation because, again, Cell does get attack plus 15% per key sphere. So just in case you actually, what am I doing here? This is actually very bad. Because uh, we're trying to say if you don't have also, um, whatchamacallit, if you don't have the SCR Majin Vegeta. So let me actually take you out here. Uh, let's actually go ahead and put, um, this is Potara. So let me go back to Resur Resurrected Warriors. That was kind of a flip there, but let me go back here. So your best looking partner if you don't have the STR Majin Vegeta. I mean, you could go Broly. That's fine. That's A-OK. -okay. Just like that. Because they do share four links together. So that's pretty, pretty good. And again, these guys are going to hit very, very hard. So yeah, you can go with this type of rotation here. Uh, another better option if you don't... I mean, if you have this character, you can actually replace Kid Buu with the Tech Cell here. So if we actually go here to Cell, let's go to... Let's go to... Let's see here. Future Saga. He should be somewhere... Is he final trump card? Final trump card. He's not. Okay, so let me actually go and check. Uh, Android. There we go. Boom. Perfect. And you can put Cell here. So Cell's would be very, very good, especially in this rotation here because he's an orb changer. He provides key. Uh, he's also gonna be good here on this rotation as well with the Broly and Vegeta, just because uh, Broly is going to be a extreme type as well here. Let's actually switch you up here, just like that. So I mean, you still have options. Broly hits very, very hard. Um, of course, he hits very hard as well here. So you want to make sure you give them the same colors key spheres with the nuking item, so they do attack. Um, they do a lot of damage here. So that's gonna be probably the team builds I can probably think of for Resurrected Warriors for the 200% uh, event here. Because again, the Resurrected Warriors they don't have that many uh, strong hitting units, but I mean they still have some good units here. So. I mean, if there's any other units I did forget, I don't think AGL is possible because this Majin Vegito, you want him at his uh, 12 key super, not his 18 key. So, not a really good option. Int, maybe Int you could do it. I'm not too sure. Just because Cell, he's not really a nuker and he gets more attack the more enemies there is. So, I don't think Int and AGL, AGL is possible. But as far as the STR physical and also the tech one, um, that is definitely possible. So,. That's going to be my team build here. Uh, I'm not sure if I cover every team build, but there is some possibility. So with that, um, I definitely want to say thank you for watching. Uh, let me know down below what's your, what's your team build going to be for the event. Are you going to use um, STR Majin Vegeta or are you going to use here, for example, this Vegeta right here, right? So again, uh, that's my two cents. Hopefully this will be able to help you guys out. I get free Dragon Stones, free other Kai's and free rewards as well. So definitely do not skip the event. And with that, I want to say thank you for watching and hopefully... I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace!